What's up and welcome to my channel. Today's video is short and sweet, how to get an audio signal out of your HDMI. So we're gonna look at how to get a red and white RCA cable or an optical cable for 5.1 surround sound out of your HDMI. So there's a few reasons why you might want to do this. You might want to hook up that old stereo system that's been laying around. It only has left and right RCAs. Or you might want to hook up your surround sound that only has a digital optical in. It doesn't have an HDMI in. So it's super easy. There's a little device on Amazon, this is Amazon's choice item here. It's an HDMI converter. And what this does is it allows you to basically get the audio signal, extract it out of the HDMI. So how this works is you'll plug your Blu-ray, DVD, computer, PlayStation, Roku, Chromecast, any one of these devices, any device you have with HDMI, you're going to plug that into this device and then you're going to plug another HDMI cable from this device to your TV. So you need two HDMI cables. Then from there you can power your amplifier or your speakers. How this works is it has a power port. It needs to be externally powered and you can see here, this is where you plug the HDMI in. So you're gonna go from your video source, whatever that may be, into this device. So you plug your HDMI in here. That's one cable. Then you, whatever you wanna do, 5.1 surround sound or your two channel RCA, you would set this switch. And then the power light would tell you obviously if it's on. Super simple and on the other side of the device here, your HDMI out, that would go to your TV. And HDMI output status light, is it working? Is it outputting video? You have your optical output. This would go towards your surround sound if you wanted digital 5.1 surround sound. Then you'd have your analog left and right RCAs. This would go to your stereo or your receiver. I will put the exact link for this WeStar HDMI audio extractor down in the description. So if you like this one, go check it out. It's a great price, great reviews. But honestly, there's tons of different options. So if you don't like this one for some reason, there's a lot of different options and they basically do the same thing. So there's the one right here I was talking about. That's Amazon's choice. I've also used this one here. And this one mentions that it has a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. There's a lot of different options. This one's got killer reviews, tons, 2000. So you make up your mind. There's tons of different options and they all relatively do the same thing. So whatever one you really choose, Amazon has a great warranty. So if you're unsatisfied, you can just contact Amazon and send it back. So hopefully I answered all of your technical sound questions today. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and I'm always here. So if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. Until next time, this is the Review King signing out.